So this is the official Brado Real 24 with humidity pump unboxing video. I've been on the hunt for a good incubator for a while now. We've looked at a couple models, including the GQF cabinet incubator, a couple others. I'll explain in a moment why I decided on this particular incubator. So the most important part is the humidity control system that comes with this incubator. As many of you know, with the chores and the family, time is of the essence and managing humidity is not practical. So that was a huge selling point. Secondly, all the components and parts in this particular incubator are manufactured in-house in Italy. So that kind of keeps quality control mm -hmm. and standards to a certain level. Barato also incorporates an antimicrobial compound in the plastic, so that helps with disease control. That's another big bonus. And the hatching trays are super cool. So basically you can fit any type of egg, any size egg in the hatching tray. All in all, for $346 as opposed to the $706 GQF cabinet incubator, I felt this would be our best choice. Best for our money and uh, best for time management. So we have our invoice, a thank you card from where we bought it, Premier One, a little instruction manual, and the incubator itself. So this will be the top part. Looks like it's got the heating element and the fan enclosed in the top casing. Instructions for the humidity pump. A little hatching tray. First thing I notice is this: the sizes are nice. We do a lot of quail and their feet tend to fall through on our Chinese incubator. Um, so that'll be nice to give them more stability in their footing. Here's our awesome humidity pump. So basically this goes into a secondary bottle of water. This is the sensor, plugs right into the ports. You set your humidity setting to whatever desired setting and it auto manages your humidity. So you can take that out of the equation. So that's one of the big selling points. Super excited about that. Let's get this box out of the way. Here is our bottom tray. So you have your automatic turner here. This is where the humidity pump plugs in. We have our hatching tray. Super cool design. So you can do four quail eggs, a goose egg. Um, it's pretty much designed to allow any egg configuration with uh, secure settings. So this is pretty cool. I think it does up to 96 quail eggs and uh, 24 chicken eggs, duck eggs. This is removable. Easy cleaning. So here's how it looks completed. Lid on, hatching trays inside. Feels good. It's not cheap plastic. It's not too heavy, but sensors enclosed. So that's pretty cool. It keeps it protected. That snaps on the inside. And these little guys snap in the front here. I think my only uh, thing I'd like would be cool to have like a little side mount for this. That would be kind of neat. Uh, one thing I noticed, it looks like it's going to be a little heavy on the power supply. So we have a power supply for the turner, a power supply for the heating element, and also a separate power supply for the auto humidity control module. So we're gonna need a couple plugs for this bad boy. So we're gonna go ahead and put some duck eggs in here, some quail eggs, and we're gonna check it out. We'll keep you guys posted and we'll let you know how it goes with uh, some updates and uh, our recommendations, reviews, good and bad. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. Like, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you can be alerted for our latest content.